Hello, welcome back to today's video. I'm so excited to have you here. I just wanted to do a little get ready with me. Today's video is gonna be basically all the products that I will pretty much be using all spring and summer long. I love getting dolled up and I love accessories and I love playing with makeup, but when it comes, I'm a summer girl. So when it comes to spring and summer, I like things being very, I like being natural. I just love the air textured dry hair look. I love that sun-kissed bronzed look like like that's that's my happy place. I'm going to share a little bit how I at the very end after I do my makeup how I got my hair to do this. It'll be just a sped up video with the little magic hand that I found that I attached to my Dyson hair dryer just to kind of help create some of the volume. And then for my makeup, you'll see me doing today's look. But I just wanted to sit down, do a little get ready with me. I hope you enjoy this video. I will link everything down below and keep watching for today's tutorial. <laughs> Okay, before we get into today's word of the day in Portuguese, we're doing something new here, right? Where you get to learn a Portuguese word since I'm from Brazil and I speak Portuguese. Today's word is going to be hair. And because we're doing hair later on in today's video, now you can learn what hair is in Portuguese. Are you ready? Hair in Portuguese is cabelo. Say it again. Cabelo. Cabelo. Now let's get to today's tutorial. Because there's so much noise and so much madness going on, I will try to do this as fast as possible and without as many distractions as we possibly can. But you know what? If you hear Pepper barking in the back, I am so, so sorry. But we're gonna jump right into the tutorial. I'm gonna first use the Milk Hydro Primer. This is a grip primer. I probably, I'm gonna, I'm gonna switch this off between using this on and off every day just because this is such a grippy primer and it really adheres to your foundation. But because here in Houston, it gets so dang hot and humid. This is actually a great primer for this weather. It's just probably not an everyday primer I will use. It's not a very hydrating primer. It's just, it's very sticky and very tacky for the foundation to stick. And I'm gonna go in straight in with the Giorgio Armani. This is the Luminous Silk. I really, really like this for every day. It gives you a very pretty luminous glow of a foundation. It's not full coverage. You can build it up a little bit, but for an everyday wear, I think something that's really light and just gives you some coverage, this is a great foundation. The only thing I really don't love about the foundation, it's really liquidy and really runny as you can see, but this is a really, really pretty foundation as you can see while I blend this. Okay, so this is what one coverage looks like. As you can see, it does not full coverage, but it does give you a very pretty even coverage. So I'm gonna go in with the Giorgio Armani Concealer. I think I have to exchange and get a shade darker. This is shade three, and I feel like it's just a little bit too white and bright. Once I have everything blended, it looks fine, but I feel like it's just a little bit too white, especially for during the summer where I tan a lot and I get um, a little bit dark. And this concealer is also very, very light coverage. Or not light coverage, it, it gives you pretty coverage, but it is very light. It's not a thick, heavy concealer like the Tape Shape by any means. So I'm going to actually let that sit in a little bit. I'm gonna spray some setting spray. And I do a lot of setting spray and setting powder, again, because I live in Houston and it is humid as heck here. And so I just want, even if I have something light and I don't want it to move, I will use a lot of setting spray and um, a translucent powder just because I really need it to stick. So I'm gonna let that sit a little bit. Let's do my eyebrows. What I'm going to use is the NYX Micro Pencil. And I'm just going to lightly, you hear Audrey? I'm going to just lightly fill in my brows just because I don't want anything heavy. So now I'm going to blend this concealer in here. And because this is just an everyday easy look, I'm not gonna put a whole lot of concealer and kick things on just because I want this to be very light for summer and spring. Okay, we're gonna go in with just a little bit of um, translucent powder to set some of the areas here that I tend to get oily. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going in with my NARS, and this is the Sunkissed Bronzing Cream, and this is in shade Laguna. 
This smells so, so good. And this is very, very like, so as you can see, I don't have a lot on my brush at all. And this packs a lot of color. So what I like to do is look, like that's a lot. I like to just put it on my hand a little bit and then just kinda blend it on my face here. Don't need a lot of this at all. But this does give you a very pretty, very, very pretty color. I am going to apply my 24 hour brow setter here on top of my brows, just to keep them in place. And then for my eyes, I'm going to use the NARS. This is the Summer Sol Solstice, 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 Solstice. Palette, this is also a really pretty, pretty palette. Look at all these colors. The shimmer on these palettes are beautiful. I love using colors like this for an everyday look, especially some of these shimmer shades during the summer, just because they're just because they're really pretty and easy to apply. You're basically just applying one color, and if you want, you can go back in with a fluffy brush Whoop. and just kind of blend it out and diffuse it on the crease. I'm gonna go in with this pink to match my dress. I'm gonna go in with, this is a seduced, hey. <laughs> it's a really, really pretty color. And just so you can see some of the swatches here, these are some of the colors. You can see some of the pigment and the shades and the color are really, really pretty. And then I'm gonna just take my M124 Morphe brush and I'm just gonna apply it onto my lid. And then on colors like this, you can diffuse it for a really pretty soft shimmer or you can really pack it in and add some Fixing Plus spray and really make it like Glittery. I'm going to take my fluffy brush and I'm, I just dipped it into Seven Heaven to apply on my lid just to kind of diffuse some of the color. Okay, I did both the eyes. I'm going to now curl and put my mascara. Does this freak anybody else out? <laughs> okay, mascara is on. And then what I am going to do is because I want more of a bronzy summer sun-kissed look, I will go instead of a highlighter that's a little bit more pink and white like this, I will go for something that's a little bit more golden like this. So let's go for some highlighter. This is literally going to be my everyday look minus I will probably switch out either the lip color or the eyeshadow just because I am obsessed with this combo. This bronzer, especially for the summer. Ooh. I'm going to skip the blush. I'm just gonna keep that bronzed look. And then what I'm going to do, I'm gonna take my Iconic London Spray because this has a little bit of a shimmer just to, again, why not? So for lip color, we're gonna go in with the Pat McGrath and this is the Skin Sane. The packaging on this, guys, look at this. Look at this packaging. I strictly bought this just for the packaging, but come to find out, this lip color is also beautiful. And so there you have it. This is the look. You can see it is very luminous, very hot. You can see the highlighter, you can see the glow. Really, really pretty, very just natural. Like I just, you know, got back from the beach and I've been tanning all day, but I really haven't. So yeah, I will link everything I used down below in the description box. If you have not subscribed, don't forget to subscribe. Thumbs up if you like this video. Comment down below, have you tried any of these products? Now I'm gonna go do my hair. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you guys, I'm gonna try to record with my phone and also show you how I'll be doing my hair this um, summer because we'll probably be swimming a lot with you know, being at the new house with the pool. And so I'm gonna try to keep my hair as healthy as possible with you know, the sun and the bleach and the, all of that. So I'm also gonna share how I'm gonna be doing my hair because I got this new little tool hand for from Ulta that's like a little hand, but it just kind of helps with the curls. My hair is not curly by any means. It's more wavy, but I just love the volume and that air dried texture that it gives. Again, don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up, comment down below, and I will see you guys here again.